my name is Kenneth Jerza. I'm a member of the Teltan Nation in Northwestern BC. I'm currently living in Prince George. <laughs> I've served the Aboriginal sports community for the past 30 years and most of those as president of Aboriginal sports. From our humble beginnings, our organization has gone through some major changes and a lot of growth. Um, and this award is just one of them. So I encourage everybody to get to know what your organization is doing and get involved. I am the Northeast Regional Lead for the Indigenous Sports Activity Recreations Council. And we're here to celebrate the 2022 Regional Premier's Award for Indigenous Youth Excellence in Sports. We are also here to celebrate the recipients for this award for the Northeast region of Ice Park, for their dedication to their culture, leadership, and personal success in their chosen sports. Our Aboriginal communities need more examples of emerging young leaders who can serve as examples of what is possible with effort, dedication, hard work, and the appropriate supports. You have honored your family, communities, your nation, your province, and especially yourself. So on behalf of the Indigenous Sports Activity Recreation Council of BC, we, sh we show you that we see you and want to congratulate you on your success. Remember, someone is watching, so lead by example, and enjoy your time in the sun. Congratulations. Hi, my name is Lana Popham. I'm the Minister of Tourism, Arts, Culture and Sport. I'm joining you today from the territory of the Lekwungen peoples, known today as the Songhees and Esquimalt nations. On behalf of Premier Eby, it's such a pleasure to congratulate this year's regional finalists of the Premier's Awards for Indigenous Youth Excellence in Sport. The province is pleased to support this initiative through iSpark, and we thank them for the championing of sport for Indigenous youth in the province. To the young athletes and leaders who were selected, you were chosen not only for your achievement in your sport, but also for your commitment to your culture and your contribution to your communities. We're so proud of all of you for everything that you have accomplished on and off the field. Sport has the power to change lives, and I know that you've already inspired others to follow in your footsteps. I encourage you to continue to pursue your dreams. Congratulations. Kendra's a natural athlete. Whether it's on the court, field, or rink, she's bringing her teammates together. This assistant captain received the Indigenous Athletic Award from her school district for the second year. There aren't many teams nearby, but that doesn't stop Kendra. For two years, she's driven three hours just to get to hockey practice for the regional elite team. Her culture is a big part of her life. She volunteers at her nation's rodeo and memorial hockey tournament held in honor of her grandfather. She's learning Cree with her mom and loves to hunt. Kendra wants to play university hockey and become a teacher, following in her mom's footsteps. Kendra Schlamp. Hello, my name is Kendra Schlamp. I'd like to thank iSpark for this opportunity and my family and coaches for support. Claire balances university and playing soccer on top of volunteering and tutoring at the UNBC First Nation Center. An academic All-Canadian, she was awarded the Indigenous Student Athlete Award and was grateful to make a drum with an elder for another student. Passionate about her ancestry and culture, Claire is often in the smudge room at school when she isn't studying hard for her minor in First Nation Studies. On top of supporting her teammates and her community, Claire wants to work in healthcare, using the same grit and determination she's developed on the field to help others. Claire Turner. Hi, my name is Claire. I'm from Fort St. John, BC, located on the traditional territory of the Deneza peoples. I'm honored to be recognized as the regional recipient of the Premier's Awards for Indigenous Youth Excellence in Sport. I want to thank Icebark, my coaches, the staff at the UNBC First Nation Centre, and my family for all being integral parts of my excellence in sport. 
I value being a leader because I take pride in helping others reach their own goals. I want to congratulate all the other recipients for their hard work on and off the field. It's an honor to be named alongside you. Thank you. Rowan grew up playing many sports, but during the pandemic, his love for volleyball dominated, and he's been spiking for both his school and club teams ever since. He's made lasting friendships and a strong work ethic thanks to the game. A leader on the court, he's also a role model, taking after his parents who are also leaders in the community. He volunteers as a referee and officiates at tournaments. Embracing his ancestry, he loves potlatches and took part in his first sweat lodge ceremony. Rowan hopes to play at university, setting an inspiring example for the next generation. Rowan T.G. Zartorski. Hello, my name is Rowan T.G. Zatorski. I am honored to be a recipient of the Youth Excellence Award. I'm very thankful for my teammates, my coaches, and uh, all my supporters for helping me get here and to uh, where I am with the volleyball. I'm also thankful for all my coaches and opportunities I had to get this far. Thank you. As soon as Curtis's dad built a rink in his yard when he was three, he was tying up his hockey skates. Soon he was racking up MVP awards, eventually helping his team win gold at Provincials in 2019. Assistant captain of the St. John Huskies, he's been named most exciting player and rookie of the year, on top of being the league's top scorer. In between leading his teams on the ice, Curtis is an indigenous support worker, helping students learn about indigenous culture. He's even learned how to set up a teepee with his elders. Curtis is proud to be a mentor to these students, showing them the value of balancing the demands of sports and school. Curtis Lee. Hi, my name is Curtis Lee. I'm Cascadena, member of the Dees River First Nations. I am honored to be recognized as a regional recipient of the 2022 Regional Premier Awards for Indigenous Youth Excellent in Sport. Thank you to iSpark for this recognition. I'd like to thank my parents and coaches for supporting me in my passions and sports. I'm currently working as an Indigenous student support worker while playing hockey, getting a chance to help kids both on and off the ice. I'd like to say congratulations to the other recipients and thank you to the organizers and supporters of this award. Keisha is a team player in every way, helping her volleyball team come 16th at nationals. This MVP plans to lead them back to provincials and nationals, but as the sportsmanship award winner on her team, Keisha cares more about supporting her teammates than winning. As dedicated as she is on the court, she's also passionate about her culture. She helped form the indigenous club at school. She values learning from her grandma and even used traditional beading to make her grad dress. A professional firefighter, this resilient athlete wants to show girls they can follow their own path. Keisha Pontias. I'm honored to be recognized as a regional recipient for the 2022 Regional Premier Awards for Indigenous Youth Excellence in Sports. Thank you, Charles Kramer, for being an amazing teacher, my biggest supporter for this award, and having so much faith in all of your students and everyone that you have come to know in school and thank you for being a good friend. Thank you to my mom. You have done so much for me. You've helped pay for all my volleyball basically and been here through my big journey and adventure with the Indigenous Club, volleyball, everything. You've been here the whole time Thank you for staying and being the best mom. Even if I don't show a lot of appreciation to you, I really do appreciate everything that you've done for me. Thank you, Dylan and Nick. You guys are the best coaches I've had. And especially thank you for sticking around for four years and dealing with all of the team shenanigans and thank you for helping me get to where I am today with volleyball, with my skills, and 
helping me become a better leader and teammate throughout all the years. Thank you, Cobras. You guys were the best team that I could have ever asked for. You guys were supportive, nice, caring. You were always there when somebody was in need of something. You guys were amazing and I will cherish all of our memories and all of our adventures and our winnings for the rest of my life. Thank you guys so much for being the best team. Congratulations, all other recipients. I'm proud to be named a regional recipient alongside all of you athletes. Thank you to the organizers and supporters for recognizing our accomplishments on and off the courts and fields. Josiah moved away from home to play for the PG Bobcats, an impressive feat at his young age. Next, he made the Caribou Cougars, helping them come second at the Pat Quinn Classic Hockey Tournament. Not only was he named player of the game when he led his team to provincials, he also received the citizenship award from his nation. He harvests food for his family by fishing, hunting, and berry picking, inspiring younger generations in his community. It's important to Josiah to give back to his nation. When he's home, he gives motivational speeches encouraging his peers about the value of sport. Felipe Josiah Lassert. Hello, Sai Josiah Lassert, Sadney. Snip Bernadette Lassert, Spit Philip Lassert. I am from the Lake Bavie Nation. I'd like to thank Ice Park and the province of British Columbia for this opportunity to receive the Premier's Award for Indigenous Youth Excellence in Sports. I want to thank everyone who has helped me on this journey, including my nominee, Big Guy, my mom, dad, sister, brother, aunt, and uncle, and grandparents especially my trainers and coaches. Without your support, I would not be where I am today. I would also like to congratulate all the other recipients of this award. I would say, Masai Cho. In small town, northern Saskatchewan, Frederick didn't have a hockey team he could join, but that didn't stop him from working hard to be a top scorer when he finally had the chance. He helped his team finish fourth at the PG Aboriginal Hockey Championships on top of playing basketball and softball and coaching younger kids. Besides excelling in many sports, Frederick embraces his ancestry through fishing and hunting. He also loves powwows and helping with feasts. He plans to go to university and hopes to help other budding athletes find their own love of sports. Frederick Bear. Tanse, Amasa, greetings to all. First and foremost, I'd like to thank my parents, grandparents, and all my coaches. Thank you to Taylor and Colton Morrell for your continuous support in school and on the field. I am extremely honored to be recognized as a recipient of the 2022 Regional Premier's Award for Indigenous Youth Excellence in Sport. Thank you, Ice Park, for this truly humbling award, and congratulations to all other recipients. Josh is a powerhouse on the ice, earning multiple MVP and Player of the Game awards. At the Terrace and Smithers hockey tournaments, he was named top scorer and led his team to gold. Naturally, he was awarded most inspirational player in the entire division. This honor roll student also cares about his community. He volunteers with the local minor hockey team, helping young players on the ice. Josh is passionate about harvesting fish. He jars it with his elders and loves connecting with them at events. He's even been learning his traditional language since he was old enough for school. Josh Layton. Josh Layton, DYU, Matakala, DOYU, Kane, up. My name is Josh Layton. I am from Malakala and I live in Prince Rupert. I am honored to be recognized as a regional recipient of the 2022 Premier's Award for Indigenous Youth Excellent in Sport. Thank you to my family and all my coaches. You have made me the dedicated athlete I am today. I am proud to be named a regional recipient alongside all the other athletes. Thank you to iSpark and the supporters and organizers for this award. 
for recognizing all our accomplishments. Thank you. Deshaun has come a long way in the 12 years she's been dazzling judges and audiences on the ice. Her long list of gold and silver medals have earned her recognition beyond the podium. She's been in publications like Native Hoop many times. She was named Most Improved Intermediate at her skating banquet and is getting certified as a trainer so she can help share her talent with other hopefuls. Deshaun also volunteers twice a week teaching can skaters, always looking for ways to support others. She hopes to place at the Super Series in Kelowna this year and inspire others through her hard work. Tayshawn Angeline Henry. Hello, I am Tayshawn Angeline Henry and I am super honored to receive this Premier Award. I would like to thank my parents and my coaches, who is Robin Henry, Leon Henry, Jacqueline Leniwick, Joanne Bartlett, and Heather Hanna, and my past coach, Jennifer Keeney. I would also like to say is never give up on your dreams. It might get hard, but just keep going. No matter how long it takes, it is super worth it. Anyways, um, thank you. Bye.